two classes were given identical quizzes. Class A had a mean score of 8.6 and a standard deviation of 0 0.9. Class B had a mean score of 8.4 and a standard deviation of 0 0.4. And we're asked two questions, which class scored better on average and which class had more consistent scores. Average is the same as mean, so we can answer the first question of which class scored better on average by analyzing the mean score for each class. So notice how class A had a mean score of 8.6 and class B had a mean score of 8.4. Because class A had a higher mean, we can say that class A scored better on average. However, it should be noted that the mean is affected by outlier scores or scores that are extremely high or extremely low. Next, we're asked which class had more consistent scores. We can answer this question by analyzing the standard deviation. Notice how class A had a standard deviation of 0 0.9 and class B had a standard deviation of 0 0.4. Let's look at our notes below on standard deviation. The standard deviation is a measure of variation based on measuring how far each data value deviates or is different from the mean. Standard deviation is always positive. Standard deviation will be zero if all the data values are equal and will get larger as the data spreads out. So notice how because class A has a larger standard deviation, the data is more spread out from the mean and class B has a smaller standard deviation so the scores are less spread out from the mean. So we can say that class B, because the standard deviation is less than class A, would have more consistent scores. So class B had more consistent scores. And again, like the mean, the standard deviation is highly influenced by outliers, meaning very low scores or very high scores. I hope you found this helpful.